Okay, this tutorial is related to a sound card problem. So let's start Sony Vegas and a sound card was removed from this computer and since then every time this error message is displayed CTACO warning. There are no creative audio products installed and running on the system that support ACO. So let's remember this CTACO click OK, OK and OK three times and Sony Vegas after this it's working just fine and if I restart the program the error message is back and I have to click three times that OK button so to fix this problem go to programs and features and search for creative and uninstall all the programs if you're not using that sound card anymore okay and after that let's use a search tool I'm pressing my hotkey and the program appears it's called everything and is in this search program let's search for this file CTACO CTACO and here we can see that it's a DLL file and there's the path where that file is let's click on path to sort it by the drive okay and let's simply rename it I'm going to cut down the last L from the file name let's cut it down from each and every one which is stored on the C drive I'm replacing it with an underscore okay so that one it's on the E drive so I'm cutting it down only from those files which are stored on the C drive and this file ctaco64.dll cannot be renamed and let's try it as you can see the file name is back let's try to rename it under safe mode and search in this folder C windows and system 32 so let's restart the computer restart and enter safe mode and the computer is starting up and here on the operating system selection menu we can even use another windows or just enter the safe mode of windows 8.1 so i'm going to go to windows 8.1 and press f8 on the keyboard f8 and now the first one is safe mode let's click that one so now I'm entering the safe mode of Windows 8.1 okay we're in safe mode let's close this window let's open a file explorer okay and go to the C drive Windows folder system 32 and let's search for CTACO there it is CTACO now let's press F2 on the keyboard and cut down the last L I'm replacing it with an underscore press enter and it's renamed let's search up here in the search box for more CTACO files and here we can see that some of these files are already renamed okay now let's restart the computer and enter windows 8.1 in a normal manner restart and now from this menu let's start windows 8.1 press enter and then we will start sony vegas again Okay, we are back in Windows 8.1 and let's start Sony Vegas 13. The program is starting and the error message is not present anymore. We can start it again and the error is gone. That's the logo of the program and there is no error message. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.